grant me the power to break through this barrier and to send the skull to the depths of oblivion. Oh, oblivion. He's deceiving you. Oh. When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. <gasps> oh my god! Quickly, kill him now. What? Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. Hey, Arinder, guess how I ended this quest last time? <laughs> When we had last left, the last Dragonborn. They were in the far northern coastal town of Dawnstar, a seemingly quaint harbor fishing village filled with merriment and snowtime wonder. But no, do not let its quaint appearance fool you, for in fact, this was a place plagued by trouble and terror. Indeed, the residents of Dawnstar had been under some sort of foul curse. A nightmarish curse that did give them nightmares. An unwaking dream that held their feet to the flames of oblivion. Indeed, the source of this treachery seemed to emanate from none other than the nearby and eerily named Nightcaller Tower. It was a priest of Mara who was going through town that had told the Dragonborn his hypotheses and ideas behind this terrible origination point, the epicenter of the trouble. Deep within did they find the telltale signs of the Daedric Prince, Vermina, not Nocturnal, Vermina, the one who controlled their dominion of freakish dreams and nightmares. There did the priest, Erinder, uncover a whole bunch of weird miasma that did fill the tower with its ancient terrible brew. And the Dragonborn did promise their aid in assisting the whole city town of Dawnstar and ridding them of Vermina's wretched curse. However, there were a few hiccups along the way, and there was a strange barrier in place, but Erinder seemed to know a little too much. Erinder quickly then did reveal to the Dragonborn, the last Dragonborn, that Erinder was in fact an acolyte of Vermina. Yes, once currently now a priest of Mara, but once before an acolyte at this very freakish tower. And so the Dragonborn would have to use all of his strength and all of Erinder's ancient forbidden knowledge to access the Dream Stride and pass by a barrier to disarm the miasmic taint that filled this tower. And so the Dragonborn had nearly reached their goal, but there was one thing that needed to be completed. Slurping that big old gulp, baby. Slurp, slurp, slurp. And so... <laughs> that hurt my... That physically did me some harm. <laughs> and so the dragonborn was prepared to ingest... Vermina's... Trippy, dippy torpor. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. Let's get the fuck in here. <laughs> I don't know what the fuck is happening to me, why I decided to do such a extra melodramatic fucking opening there, but hey, you know what? Enjoy it. Enjoy it. All right. Let's see here. Let's scarf down some of this shit, huh? Wouldn't it be cool if when I drank this, it uh, made my restfulness my slumber refresh like I, I got some restfulness in my in me in my <laughs> god all right let's see where is it even hmm what's it technically called verminas torpor yeah okay oh there it is it looks like a healing potion verminas torpor priceless 
enter the dream stride for an unknown length of time. <gasps> Here we go. Oh! The orcs have breached the inner sanctum, Brother Varen. We must hold. We can't allow the skull to fall into their hands. But no more than a handful of us remain, brother. Then we have no choice. The miasma must be released. Y'all just miasma. had it? But, brother, we have no alternative. It's the will of Vermina. Where'd y'all get this? And what about you, oh. brother Casimir? Casimir. Are you prepared to serve the will of Vermina? Yes, brother Varen Duluri. I've made my peace. I am ready. I was born ready to serve Vermina. Then it's decided. It is. Brother Casimir, oops, oops, you must oops, activate oops. the barrier and release the miasma. Let nothing stop you. Brother it Thor, shall be done. We must remain here and guard this skull with our lives if necessary. Agreed to the death. Then let it be done. Brother Varen. Yes. Me hungry. A little bit hungry. I am a little hungry. I cannot take any of these. Can I use my dragon shouts? Can I attack? No. Oh, it's Mercer Frey. What's he doing here? <laughs> Man, he's just involved in everything. My god. Brothers and sisters of Vermina, steal yourselves! The orc invaders are at our doors! Ready to smash us down! <laughs> They're very pissed about the whole nightmare situation. I don't know why we decided to fuck with them. Why? <laughs> can, I, can I find out why we decided to fuck with the orcs? We really fucked up that time! <laughs> really should have fucked with the orcs, huh? <laughs> hey, look, this is like the opening to their own Elder Scrolls game, huh? Very reminiscent of early Helgen. Look at this. Can I get killed here? Look at this guy. Yeah, look out. Yeah. Whew, that was a little scary. My butt clenched up. All right. <laughs> Let's get on out of here. All right. Wow, it's kind of cool to see all this, huh? How do you think they pulled this off? Is this like um, instancing or whatever? Look, we can't even open our inventory or anything. Just the escape menu. Oh, well, look, a whole bunch of goodies. Look at this. Someone put a lot of work into this here, huh? You go through it twice? Oh, look, these two have made friend with friends with one another. Oh my gosh, look, now they're going to fight. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought we were having like a real Romeo and Juliet moment. <laughs> Oh dear, look at this. Puny weaklings everywhere. Honestly, they they deserve it. They deserve it. Get them orcs. Alright. I you know what? Get them orcs, but also fuck you, orcs! Eat miasma! Miasma! Gassing y'all up. Mmm, yeah. Fucking suck that shit up. Oh yeah! We're getting fucked up in here forever. Oh shit. Oh damn, the crystals. Yeah, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> hey, I'm me again. Am I? Hey, do I gotta do this? <laughs> oh shit, what's going on? Uh, disable the magic barrier. Erender, I'm inside! Should I pull the chain? No, I think I gotta rip this soul gem out. Feels really dangerous to grab it while it's emitting so much power. <laughs> hey, Erender. What happens if I pull this? Oh, I can't. Okay, fair enough. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Hey, Erender. Look, yeah, naked orcs, right? Weird. How'd they get naked? I don't know. It, it worked. Mara be praised. You vanished after drinking the torpor and materialized on the other side. I've never seen anything quite like it. I thought you all made this and tested it, huh? Wait, what about your studies? You sack of shit, Erinder. I thought... <laughs> you said that you had studied and tested it and shit, didn't you? Am I am I tripping balls or did you not say that? Erinder, you are the motherest fucker of all damn time. It was remarkable, as if I were really there. It served a purpose. <laughs> what a line. Oh, seething in anger. Are you mad? I could have died. I could have died. I'm the Deborn Erinder. I thought I was clear regarding the dangers that awaited you within the Oh, place. you motherfucker. However, this hardly matters any longer, as you appear to have exited on schedule. You said it was safe as shit. We can discuss it later. We need to proceed. Indeed. 
My reverence for Vermina's machinations should not take precedence over our mission. This guy's a liar. He's like a fucking a character that I play. Ahead, Just take any opportunity to use my lie skill. Troubles. Lead on, my friend. Good God, what an anus. Can I pick Come, your pocket? We must get I to the cannot. skull and destroy it. Alright, get to the skull and stuff. Okay, fine. Fuck you, Erender. Fuck you, you sick piece of shit. I'm gonna eat some horker loaf. In rage, just furiously chowing down and chomping on this shit. I'm so fucking mad and... Oh, I'm so cross. I've never been so angry at a priest of Mara before in my life. I don't even know if I've seen another priest of Mara in my fucking life. That's how fucking pissed as shit I am. <laughs> sorry, Erinder. No, I mean, fuck you, Erinder. Alright, you know what? I, I take it back. No, no, sorry, Erinder. Here we go. Take some of these. Leave that. Oh no, it's Laser Wizard. Boom! Oh, Yamcha! There we go. I don't know why Yamcha. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm in a real fucking mood today, huh? Alright, it's not good. Let's take this. Some ultimate healing. Beautiful. Plentiful magicka. Is there something else here? Yeah. A filter of the healer. Ooh. Okay. A little pot here. Some baskets. All good stuff. Chest filled with... Oh, wow. A bunch of goodies. I'll take them all. Alright. More Magicka shit. Good. Their little observation deck right here so they can observe other people eating like a bunch of fucking creeps. What do y'all do up here? Y'all just watch other people eat? That's weird. <laughs> That's real weird. <laughs> Man, you Vermina acolytes, y'all are doing some weird shit. <laughs> fucking round with miasma. You, yeah, release the miasma. What the fuck were y'all doing? Y'all just had miasma up in this tower? What was this place? You'll just make my asthma? What the fuck? <laughs> Where's the lore on that shit? Why did you guys just have vats and vats of my asthma that just apparently never goes away and like causes time dilation? What was the reason for this? There we go. And he just decided to become a priest of Mara and leave like a tower filled with deadly time dilation miasma right next to the entire town of Dawnstar. I mean, you know, let's pause for a fact that, hey, sure, there's a Daedric Prince thing going on here, and uh, Daedric Prince got pretty fucking pissed, right? There's a tower of miasma! Just filled to the brim with miasma! <laughs> no one knew! They are sitting on top of a ticking time bomb! What happens when someday a fucking dragon, like, crashes into it or something? It just decides to fall over. I mean, fuck knows. Just a few m miles away at, uh, College of Winterhold. That shit just started falling over. Well, if some wizard sends an errant fireball over, bops a hole, and suddenly my asthma starts pouring out of this fucking tower. Everybody around the whole land goes, falls asleep, gets stuck in time. Sleepy time, forever time. Good God. Entire city just gets wiped off the fucking map. Jeez. Erinder, what are you, what are you doing, man? What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> I need to drop this. All right, let's see. Should I drop some tusk wolf pelt, perhaps? Yeah, there we go. We need to be a little bit more careful about what I'm picking up. Look, I'm, I'm being terrible. I'm so bad. All right, tomatoes, I'm eating them all. Good. Ancient tomatoes kept here, preserved by the miasma. Who even needs a refrigerator when you got miasma? Does it work on potatoes and tomatoes? If I put some in there, does it just pause them in time? Shit. Man, maybe if I if I ever get my hands on a fucking Elder Scroll, I'll just use it for food preservation, huh? We'll make some, like, Elder Scrolls... Elder Scroll made beef jerky or whatever. Dry out some apricots or something. <laughs> oh, God. Look at this. What the hell? There we are. Picking the... Pick... pick, pick ah, ah! <laughs> oh, God. It's not good. There we go. <laughs> oh, shit. This is all good stuff. Oh, I'm cursed. Oh, I don't want to drop the scimitar, do I? Oh, oh. What can I get rid of? Oh, Jeez, what can I get rid of? 
Corundum? I guess? Oh, should I get rid of the D-bones? I'm gonna have to drop one. Gotta drop a D-bone. Erendur, you made this happen. You got rid of Ilya. What did you do to her? Fill her full of miasma? She's gonna be moving in slow motion now. Jeez. Take your eggs and your blue potions. Take them all. Turn on my magic light. There we go. Keep calling them acolytes, but they're technically devotees, huh? What are you looking oh! at? Oh! Oh! <laughs> this man's alive! <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I went to press E on him to like take a potion out of him. He was like, "What are you looking at, dude?" <laughs> Good God! All right, sorry, sir. That usually doesn't ever happen to me. Okay, <laughs> what a surprise! All right. You'd think the, uh, the orcs, they would say something. They'd be like, hey, what are you doing here? Why are you looking at me as I wake up or whatever? What happened? I've been asleep for a million years, right? It's time to... <laughs> I've lost my mind. I'm an amnesiac now. I'm the starter character of a different RPG. <laughs> Good God. But no, the, didn't the miasma also, like, deteriorate their brain or something? Something drove them mad. They lost their minds, right? I think. <laughs> All right, feel the benevolence of Mara. <laughs> right, okay. Is that really what they say as they kill people? <laughs> Y'all are fucking wild. All right, let's take all this shit. There we go. Should I take a soul gem fragment? Forget what you can even do with them, if anything. I know there's a few places you can find them. Look at this guy. He got put in the miasma right as they were doing their Vermina limbo game. Okay. Oh shit, look at all this. Alright. Anything else good here? What? Oh. Oh no. <gasps> oh no. There. Thoric, you're alive. Oh shit. No thanks to you, Casimir. I no longer use that name. I'm Miranda, priest of Mara. You're a traitor. You left us to die and then ran before the miasma took you. No, I, I I was scared. I wasn't ready to sleep. Mm. Enough of your lies. I can't allow you to destroy the skull, priest of Mara. How come their minds are still intact? No choice. What lady oh Mara? shit. Maybe it never fucked with their Ooh. minds at all. Rota! Maybe this is just another fucking lie from Erender, huh? Too bad they didn't ask about me, right? <laughs> they didn't ask about me, like, yeah, wait, who's this guy who's just, like, screaming at us? Like, my god, Erendor, is this the- is this the Dragonborn? Oh, he's killing me! <laughs> oh, did you hear him whimper? Poor guy. The skull must be destroyed. Okay, Erendor. stand back. I'll perform the ritual granted to me by Lady Mara. First. An incantation to remove the barrier. Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them, huh? Hope, do you got what it takes, Erender? Do you got what it takes? Ooh, it's really giving off an egg emanation. I call upon you, Lady Mara. Oh. The skull hungers. It yearns for memories and leaves nightmares in its wake. Grant me the power to break through this barrier. To send the skull to the depths of oblivion. Oh, oblivion. He's deceiving you. Oh. When the ritual's complete, the skull will be free, and then Arinder will turn on you. <gasps> oh my god! Quickly, kill him now. What? Kill him and claim the skull for your own. Vermina commands you. Hey, Arinder, guess how I ended this quest last time? What was that? That's right, Arinder! Lucky. That's right! We're doing an alternative ending! <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> yep, that's right. I fucking killed him! I killed that man! Fuck you, Erender! Fuck you to oblivion, you piece of shit! Always lying to me, you sack of shit. Alright, for those who have not played this quest or, or even Skyrim at all, Vermeen is just tricking you. <laughs> but she's, it's, it's, it's a deception on her part. Erendur is, uh, 
He's a he can be a companion and stuff. I did it the other route. It's pretty neat that you can actually have multiple routes here, right? But hey, you know what? This time, I wanted to I wanted to go the other route. I never got the uh, achievement for getting X amount of Daedric artifacts because I I spared Erinder, right? I thought, hey, I probably shouldn't side with the demon, but this time I think, you know what? Maybe I love demons. Maybe I'm a demon lover. I don't know. This dumbass had eight torches on him. What the fuck? <laughs> what is going on there? This fucking guy has eight torches? They weigh 0.5 each in this game. This ain't fucking a bl- Oh, maybe he was in Cyrodiil. And then as soon as he crossed the border, suddenly, uh-oh, over encumbered. Should have fucking thought about that shit, Erinder. You dumb piece of shit. I'm going to take this shit here. Take this. What is this, glass sword of lethargy? Take that. All right, look at this. I'm going to come up here and I'm going to rip the skull out. Look, I'm give me your dark power, Vermina. I'll take everyone's dark power. Grant me your terrible boon. Ugh, it looks awful. It does look very evil, doesn't it? <laughs> it looks so evil. Wow. Honestly, it gives the Mesa Moloch Bowl a run for its money, doesn't it? Jeez. There we go. Waking Nightmare. Cool. Can I put it back or anything? Nope, mine now. Whose spine is this? Ugh. It just has hands growing out of it as well. It's really long, and it has hands coming out of it. Probably not what you want. All right, let's see here. Our fun staff, of our skull of corruption. 20 points damage increases to 50 points if powered with dreams collected from sleeping people. No, oh, I'm never going to use it. I just want to add it to the collection. <laughs> All right. Eat your heart out, Erinder, you piece of shit, you old bastard. Damn you to hell. <laughs> I love hating Erinder. I don't know why I didn't think of just shitting on Erinder more often, but man, it's great doing it. Let's see. Can I even get out of here? Like, good God. How can I do it? How can I leave? Am I trapped here forever? And ever? Hmm. I need some more carry weight. Oh, my charm necklace. Thank goodness. That might be just barely the ticket. Do I have anything else that increases my carry weight here? Fuck. See, if we can just get to Ilya, all of our problems will be saved and resolved. Okay. We could drink a potion. We could drink a draft of whatever. Hmm. Let's see. How much does our other one do? Potion of strength? Oh, 12. Good God, that's nothing. A solution of strength. Let's see. So that would be... That would be enough, wouldn't it? Yeah, that would put us up to... Oh, shit. No, it wouldn't. Oh, it would really not. Okay. Let's see, what's our heaviest weapon here? The ebony mace. Okay. Let's see, we'll, you, we'll do that, and then we'll drink this other thing. Our, notice our potion efficacy is down because of sleepy times, right? Jeez, Vermina, you didn't even say thanks or anything, huh? Dickhead. I killed this priest. <laughs> I've made my decision, and Erinder has died died by my hands. I now possess the Skull of Corruption and look forward to performing my duties for Lady Vermina. I mean, you know what? Honestly, although I sort of knew the outcome of all this, that fucking Erinder, he lied to me every single chance he got. Fuck that guy. <laughs> he fucked over these orcs to begin with, right? And then he fucked over his own people there at the end. Jeez. What the hell? What a dick. All right. I mean, that said, I do kind of enjoy a redemption story, but, uh... Really feel bad for the orcs, right? <laughs> really feel bad for the orcs. Hey, look what I forgot. Like a complete dangus. All right. Let's head on out now. 
Hopefully Ilya finds us or something, or we find her before my encumbrance arrives again in a major way. I should scoop up some of this, uh, some of this gaseous fume, right? I don't know. Seems like a good idea. Oh, hey! Gordon found something. Where are you, Gordon? I have no clue. Gordon has gone somewhere. Jeez. We still need to go back through the other area near the alchemy hall, right? There is a little doorway there. Oh, look, it's very bright now. Oh, shit. What's going on here? Oh, wait, this is the usual situation here. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's like, oh, no, the miasma's back. The barrier. I need another torpor. There we go. Vermina didn't give two shits about this. I fucking killed that guy. She didn't say, hey, take the staff. She wasn't like, whoa, what was that torpor thing you did? That was weird. You went into my plane of oblivion or whatever, the dream stride? You did that? I've got your back. I know, Ilya. Weird shit is just popping off what all do you the want time me to for carry? me. <laughs> all right. Here, Ilya, take some of this dumb shit that I got. Maces, skull of corruption. You want to use a skull of corruption, Ilya? I don't know. Here, take a, take a bunch of bones. Take some of these. Take all this stuff, Illy. I'm just incompetent as hell. Take some mammoth tusks. They weigh five each. Good God. Take a wolf pelt. There we go. Take all of these things. Well, no, I'll hold on to them for now. You know Lead what? On. I'll hold on to those. Okay, let's go back in and check the other section, right? Shit, maybe we'll find a bed. That'd be nice. Fucking rest. Jeez. Oh shit, can we check back in in on the town and get some closure that way? Wow, Ilya just cannot come in here. She's too afraid of Vermina. Ilya, have, have you like angered Vermina in some way? You know what, Ilya? Maybe um maybe I can get you a favor with Vermina. Cuz me and Vermina, we're like this. I'm crossing my fingers together. We're like best buds even though she never talks to me after I do all this wild shit for her. I literally killed a man. Ilya, I killed a man in here, and I killed a bunch of orcs who were probably innocent. Ilya, I'm a murderer. Are you gonna start- <laughs> Ilya's gonna start cracking jokes about me murdering Erendur and mur murdering innocent orcs who were just, like, having bad dreams. The same way that I crack jokes about her killing her mom. <laughs> Ilya, you know what? It's fair. It's all fair. I deserve it. I deserve it. Look at this. The moose has fallen over. Oh, we came out this way? Oh, shit. All right, well, there's a sack of money. That was kind of worth it. Where did I drop that other thing at? No way, it's a different instance? Oh, shit, no wonder dudes don't come inside. Followers don't come in here because it's a different instance every time? No, you're kidding me. Where'd our bone go? Where is my bone? Where's my pile of bones? Pork or meat? Where's my pile of D-bones? What has happened? Oh, what a travesty, dude. <laughs> oh! I found the bones! Where are they at? Oh, here they oh, these are the scales. Okay. Oh, God. <laughs> it sounded like the whole fucking place was coming down and it made me, like, poo a bit. Oh, God. <laughs> I forgot that they have such a, like, hefty noise. Good God. Just knock around some dragon parts and suddenly it sounds like everything's about to come crashing down upon you. Good god. Dragons are heavy, I guess, huh? Just their bones? Is they're like super ultra dense or something filled with like some sort of ancient wild magic or whatever? Blessing of like Akatosh or whatever upon ye? Who knows? Yo, where is my bone? Where's my bone stuff at? <laughs> Come on! Oh, scales. Shit. It's like impossible to see anything. Right? Here, can I foos and maybe see it that way? Maybe see it just move? Heard something move. That was a butterfly wing. Also sounds very heavy. <laughs> butterfly wing goes like crash around. <laughs> <laughs> the wing of Mothra. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Yo, what the fuck? I'm never gonna get this bone back. 
Where's my bone? Come on. My goat hide? Someone's crotch? <laughs> cool. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> That's a different kind of bone. Some leather? I guess I'll take that. Man, I just drop shit everywhere in here, huh? Okay. Good lord. I can't believe I said that I thought this was a different instance when all the bodies were everywhere, huh? Shit, I'm just dumb as shit, huh? Okay. Oh, look! A secret chest! Ooh, hidden behind a very well-hidden door. <laughs> it was just in the open. <laughs> Alright. Let's get in here. Oh, shit. Okay. Ooh! Ah, there we go. Hey, got a level. Great. Love it! Alright, let's try and keep an eye out for this magic bone. Right? Where could it be? Should I take this leather armor? Why not? I can always drop it. Alright. Where did I drop that bone? I don't even remember now. I've lost my fucking mind. Oh, no. We'll never have this bone back. I mean, I did get three of my scales. All three of them. Was it down here? Did I drop it down here? Good God. I can't even... <laughs> I can't even remember. Ilya, I wish you were in here telling me what the fuck to do. Alright. Let's see. Anything around here? No, 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 no. It was down here by the final area, right? Surely, it must have been. Oh, look, we can actually rest here. Which we should definitely do, right? This is a nice place to sleep. I mean, Lord knows they've been doing it forever. There we go. My D-bone. Great. Love it. Let's take another Vermina robe. So we have three. Okay. But didn't we also drop one all the way at the very end? Right? Or am I, like, tripping balls? Let's see. Let's get our speed boost going. So I can speedily go check. Yeah, down here by these final two assholes. Oh, look, it's Erender moving. Oh, no, he didn't move. Yeah, we killed him here, didn't we? Well, did we? Shit, no, I, don't, I don't know anything. I can't remember anything today. I've, I've lost it. All right, you know what? Maybe we didn't have anything good here. <laughs> yep, guess not. Nothing. All right. Boom! Skedaddle. Go take a snooze. Are. Good. And let's snooze it up for... Oh, geez. It's actually kind of the perfect time to be coming out of here, so maybe we'll just go for, like... I don't know, 22 hours. <laughs> Sorry, Ella, you gotta wait out there for a while. I got, uh, I got stuck in the miasma for a bit. That's what happened. I didn't... I didn't decide to take a, a long, like, 22-hour rest and nap and, you know, just sort of play around in the bed, just chill out, have a pillow fight with Gordon or whatever. <laughs> chill out with all the dead bodies, look at all the dead orcs and stuff, the orc invaders, kind of cry about it. Didn't do any of that, Ilya. Didn't do any of it all. Look at the fallen moose. Wonder how it fell on the ground, but the other two stayed up. Wonder where all the rest of the miasma is at. <laughs> What's going to happen with the, the tower here? Should we tell the Jarl about the tower filled with miasma? Eey, I don't know. <laughs> Where did it come from? Who knows? It's not in there anymore. Where did it go? How did we cleanse the miasma? How, how did we cleanse it? I'm not sure. Where did it go? I feel like the miasma is kind of a big deal, right? But then we've kind of just glossed over. Like, we, we saw the, the skull, and we're just like, oh, that, there we go, that's important. But this fucking miasma shit, jeez. Bottle some of that up and just start throwing bottles of it at people, right? Shit. Okay. Let's chow down on some trash here, right? What can I eat? What can I eat? How about some rabbit haunch? Boom, eat a couple of them. Good. All right, let's go on down and speak with the Jarl, right? Ooh, I'm excited to speak with the Jarl. All right. Oh, God. <laughs> Here we go. 
Okay, and then we'll do our super duper plan. We'll head on back to Falkreath. Do our shit in and around there, right? I'm pretty sure Erendur is like a pretty high tier companion as well. A pretty high tier follower. <laughs> so, you know what? Eh, fuck him. That's what I have to say. Who needs him? Who needs him anymore, right? Shit. I could go around with fucking Sven if I wanted, right? Look at me. I'm like fucking obliterating people. I'm the most powerful dude around now. That's right. The Khajiiti Caravan. They know what's up. Gosh, look at that snow. It's like slicked over with ice. It's causing a reflection like that. Wow. You know what? If anything, that lighting right there, what it reminds me of? Caverns in Oblivion. Right? Okay. Okay. Let's get out of here. Let's go speak with the Arl. Guess what, everybody? You all still having bad dreams? I mean, I didn't destroy the skull. I just kind of have it with me now. I work for the Wind Peak Inn. You should head on inside. Oh. Thoring runs the inn. Speak to him. Oh, okay. Well, hang on. I need to speak Wait, with the Jarl. I know you. Yeah, that's right. I'm the one who got rid of everybody's nightmares. That's who I am. That's all I am. Well, then the Deborn. Let's go into the White Hall. There we go. Uh oh. They're dead. <laughs> Where are they? Is everyone just sleeping now? Yeah, everyone's so tired. <laughs> Finally, I can sleep! Oh! No more nightmares! Oh, I don't have to dream about my teeth falling out or falling non-stop or... <laughs> What's another common nightmare? <laughs> just showing up to work or school with no pants on or something like that. Hey, what's up, Jarl Scald? The nightmares in Dawnstar have lifted, and I hear you help that happen. You have my thanks. Oh, uh, well, you have my welcome. I'm looking for work? Giants are a common problem in the Pale. Oh. The Empire always demanded I leave them be, but <laughs> the Empire isn't here now. Really? The Empire Go demanded? Go slay one of the beasts. Should let them know the Dawn Star is not to be trifled with. Oh. It will be done, I guess. Why didn't... Why didn't the Empire want them to be killed? Huh. I mean, I agree. You probably shouldn't. They're pretty peaceful. They just want to chill out and do their own thing. If anything, the only time that we've seen them aggressive was when there was, like, that shit with Malakath and all that, right? All right. It'll... It will be done. I may as well kill him. Check this cool shit out. I got the Staff of Corruption. I'm counting on you. You want to see this? Check it out, Jarl. This shit was cursing everybody. Now I giant. got it. Don't get stepped on. Hey, remember that priest? I killed him. Of his I killed Dawn that Star. guy to get this. Look at my evil fucking staff, dude. Doesn't it look sinister as shit? It's emanating like a red fuchsia from its head. That's how evil it is. Look at this. Look at... Will, it, will he be mad if I do this? Not as dumb as you look. Oh, I am. Help. Someone <laughs> never had the there we go. We Great. Poised for glory, Yard. The Empire. Just a servant of Skull the Elder. Worthy of time and consideration. Draws huh. breath. With respect, Jarl, you can't ask everyone to throw themselves against trained legionnaires. Let's leave the fight. There's no honor in being a Jarl's servant. No Southern Guard waits for dust cleaners. Too many souls fighting over it. Jeez, poor guy. Drive out the empire hey, come live with me. Your family has served Skull Felgape's family for generations. Hey, fuck that man. Years. I can come, feel it. come chill out at one of my places, dude. Struggle. Can you be a follower? Of your oh, it's just wonderful being Skull's servant. He's not demanding in the least. Good morning. Bullfrick, who you are you? Huh. Man, should I kill this old bastard? I probably will at some point, right? He's he's pro Stormcloak, so I'm probably gonna end up fucking getting him at some point or another, huh? <laughs> this is probably gonna happen eventually. What can I say? All right, let's see. Where where's this giant camp at, or whatever they're wanting me to deal with? Where is this? Let's see here. Miscellaneous quest is that what it is? Kill the giant in Blizzard Rest. Okay. Where's that? Oh, I thought it would be this one, but it is not. Oh, this isn't another Skyrim, is it? Is it gonna have me go like a million miles away? Mm, 
not a million, but pretty far. Pretty, pretty, pretty far. All right. Jesus. Hmm. Well, first and foremost, you know what? Let's head back to Falkreath, I think, right? Let's head on back to Falkreath. We can take one of these cool boats, right? Shit, this is new stuff. We came out here, we did one quest, there's still plenty more. We'll be back. I don't believe we've technically finished off any of the cities and settlements, right? But we have been to all of them. Drive Baytild out of business and force her to apologize to me for everything she's done. What is this feud you have with your wife? What started this? I don't want to talk Wait, about it. Wait, with his wife? You don't want to talk about it or you don't know? I don't want to talk about it. I know. Me and this shirtless man, we can see a bald asshole when we know it. Or we know a bald asshole when we see him. <laughs> What's up, Lon? I'm mine. Work the smelter. Ain't much else to tell. All right. If it's about the mine, I'm all ears. Nah. Now, if you'll excuse me. Okay. Let's see. I'll take a boat to. Uh, I don't know. Where do you where do you have Everyone boats thinks to? I'm too young to be a ship's captain, but I'm going to prove them wrong. Okay. Sure. Ravam Varethi. I could run this ship better than that boy who calls himself a captain. Maybe one day I'll do something about it. Hey, you're the you're one of the people who says it to him. Oh, it's you. Okay. What about you, Guthrum? I plan to spend all the days I got left on the water. It's where I belong. Ah, uh, he doesn't give a shit. He's just here to have a good time. I don't all buy right. all that talk about ship captains having to be stern and strict. I want my crewmen to enjoy their work. Hey, Captain the Wayfinder, captain I can get behind the that. Sea squall from his mother when she died. Maybe I can inherit the ship if he dies. Hey, Captain, I think this guy's gonna mutiny the shit out of you. I think he's gonna mutiny you so hard you're gonna fucking die. I'm good with stars and charts, but I admit I've got some things to learn about leading men. You're the ship captain? By inheritance, as my men are fond of saying. Can't blame them. My mother ran the sea squall as strictly as she ran the house. I've been trying to find new areas of business. Trying to win the sailors' respect, but I keep having problems. Oh no. Take the last trade we did. Some fine cut void salts from the College of Winterhold. Plenty of coin if you know who to sell it to. What happened to the salts? Don't bother asking, I'm not interested. <laughs> I like how like weather world worn or world weary we are <laughs> with this response. Alright, what happened to the salts? I wanna tell me about the salts! You lost some void salts? Come on! I'm the Dragonborn! Tell me what's what's going on with the void salts. Come on. I helped a guy find ten fire salts. I can mess with some void salts. What's going on? Sailors are what happened to them. They got drunk and ended up losing the merchandise in some cave. Oh, not no. Of a little exploring. I'll pay good gold to get those salts. All right. Until next time. Fine. Find the fine cut. I don't want like taking orders from a boy. So it's a. I uh, need the gold. It's a specific I quest item, so we can't accidentally, like, fuck that one up. Where I belong. All right. Well, we cannot take this boat <laughs> anywhere in any way. Okay, great. I Are we sh oh, wait. Better than that boy this person over here. Captain. Wait, is this guy a boat captain. lord? Hang on, do I have my sprint? Yep. <gasps> Yo! Dude, are you like the secret super captain? Looking to hire a boat? No way, this is the secret super captain! I can take you to any port on the coast. Fuck. Okay. Where are you headed? <laughs> Shit, man, I don't even know. Do I have a quest in Windhelm or anything? Burglary job. Markarth. Numbers. Solitude. Oh shit, I guess we're going to solitude, huh? It may not look like much, but my boat can get you there faster than walking. Yeah, shit. Where are you headed? Alright, I'm going to solitude. Climb on in the boat and get comfortable. Oh, I've never done this. Use fairy seat. Oh look, there's seats for all of us. Well, Gordon can ride in my lap or something, or on my shoulder like a Pikachu. Just like pinch right into my flesh and just hang on, <laughs> just cling right onto me. <laughs> I'll have to use cast a healing spell the whole time so I don't fall over dead from it. Oh shit! <laughs> my fucking uh, 
<laughs> My moose Mabel. Deja has no words for you. Oh. What? You have no knowledge of who you speak to. You're no absolutely way. right. You probably want someone else. I'm just the stable boy. Oh my god! He's a ghost. Guys? You want them in your belly? No? Then you stop talking to DJ. Damn, DJ's fucking rough and tumble. Okay. Let's get on out of here. Oh shit! Whoa! Whoa! Oh! <laughs> it's a Christmas miracle! Oh. Oh, Saturalia miracle, I should say. Good god. Here we go. <laughs> Where's that blacksmith at? I gotta go forge some fucking numbers, baby. Hi ho, silver and away. Zoom! This thing goes pretty quick, huh? Is this like a high speed mount or what? Shit, it feels like it. Look at this. I feel cool as hell. Alright. Oh, yeah, you know what? I didn't write down anyone's name, but someone was commenting on, uh,. This, like, moose's reindeer's butt? And I see it now! It looks like a cock and balls from behind! It looks like a cock and balls from behind! The reindeer's ass looks like a cock and balls! <laughs> Man! Eat your heart out, Cyberpunk! We got it here too, baby! You didn't think we had it? We were packing heat? Fuck! Watch out! Watch out for the fucking sons of Skyrim, baby! <laughs> Fuck me! Gosh, this game is great. <laughs> Where's the blacksmith? Are we tracking it? Am I tracking it? Yeah, I'm tracking it. All right, let's get let's get up here. Fuck me! Oh, this shit is amazing. All right, let's see here. Let's, let's. You see. should see me when you get bored, stranger. Oh, I'm not anywhere near bored. I got like a bazillion fucking quests. All right, let's see. Like quests like this, where I have to go fuck around in this guy's stupid books. Look at this shit. I can't even find his stairs up. All right. Hope he doesn't come up here. Hope he didn't notice me. <laughs> All right. Oh, he just leaves it out here like this, too. What a fool! Oh, a master lock as well. Oh, shit. Alright. Let's give it a... Oh, shit. Okay. You know what? We did pretty good that time, though. All things get... Oh, shit. All things considered. God. Okay. Oh! <laughs> okay. Oh, oh! I'm not in a good way for this right now. Oh God! Oh my God! Okay, okay, okay. Just right about. Oh shit! Okay, okay, right here, right here. Mmm. Put it up a bit. Oh, there we go. Mmm. Gold ingot. I love it. They got any food up here? Got anything for me to eat? Oh shit, some glow dust. Void salts too, fuck. They got rare shit. What's this, a ragged cap? Oh, I think they're coming up. Uh-oh. Troll slang. Have I read about troll slang yet? I don't, I don't know if I have. Shit, I'm detected, but I think it's by no one in particular. Oh, I think I've definitely read this. I think I remember the picture of the troll. Okay. A flute, real baron's eye, ingol and the sea ghosts, thief of virtue, harvesting some venom, cats of Skyrim. Oh! You caught me! <laughs> hey, Heimvar! What's up? Just arrive in the city? Is it true what they say, then? There are dragons about. It's true. Do you make anything here that will kill dragons? I like you. I like you too, you no asshole. Man is a match for a dragon. Buying oh. one of our blades wouldn't hurt your chances, though. Okay. You should see me, though. I'm, I'm, I do pretty good these days. Early on, not so much. These days, eh, they give me some problems, but you know. All right. What, what does this job pay? What, what job? Your job as a blacksmith? Food, 
experience? Yeah, literally. Roof over my head in the finest city in Skyrim. If money's all you hold dear, then you end up like Jari Ra, a plague on the city. What's your problem with Jari Ra? Captain Aldis can't prove it, but that Argonian is up to no good. What? May your sword feast on Stormcloak flesh. Wow, damn, dude. Okay. Is Jari Ra the, um, the fence that we have access to? Oh my god, look at all these. Okay. You know what? Thanks, you asshole. <laughs> Thanks, you asshole! Let's see. I took something here that I don't want. What did I take? What was it? Tongs. All ah, right. Ditch that. <laughs> oh my god, look at all this shit! Oh my god, Ilya, this is a fucking You'll jack- I've got your back. Oh, I would never think about it, Heimvar. What do you want me to carry? Ilya, take all the shit. Take all the shit, Ilya. Oh, look, take take the dragon shit. There we go. Let's get going, then. <laughs> Beautiful. I love it. All right. Oh, no, wait. We should do some cooking in his house, right? Look, he had a, he had a cooking stand up top, didn't he? Here, blacksmith's place. Perfect place to cook. Right? Anything in your treasure chest, by the way? Oh, some goat and horse hide. I could make use of that. Ingots as well. <laughs> Yo, this guy's clueless. I'm taking all of his shit. Fucking forging his shit. I'm just taking all of his fucking raw ore and stuff. He's just got shit laying all over the place. Let's see here. Can I make like a beef stew? Yeah, beef stew. That's good, right? Yeah, stamina. All right. Let's make five of these. Beautiful. Horker loaf. Mmm. Whoop. Don't want to make a hot soup. How about some potato soup? Why not? Make a little bit of that. Make some rabbit haunch. Salmon steak. Beautiful. Good, good, good. All right. We're doing great. We're doing great. Let's eat some of that potato soup so we don't get like super famished or whatever it's called. Where did it go? Potato soup. Good. Good, good, good. You need to leave. Oh, all right. I'm getting out. Closing time, huh? Okay. Now let's take the carriage to Falkreath, huh? There we are. And maybe we can get the wait. I know manor or whatever it's called there. I think so. There we are. I wrote down all of my my fun and fancy plans for each of the three locales, right? I do want to build them all up. Okay, let's go over here. <laughs> we need to get a normal horse, don't we? Now that I've seen it, I can't unsee the cock and balls. <laughs> Look at it! It's got a little dingling just hanging off of its butt! Oh, God. <laughs> it's a Satterellia miracle. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Fuck. All right. Jeez. Yeah, send me to Falkreath. Send me down there. Let's see. Let's go to Falkreath, baby. I'm ready. I'm ready. I don't think we've ever taken one to Falkreath. What will you, you tell me? Met one of them cats. Uh, you're telling me this? Khajiit, I think they call themselves. Dude, aren't they just right the over there? Countries full of them down south. Yeah. Will he say that if you are a Khajiit? Will he still say that? <laughs> That'd be so fucking funny. <laughs> oh god, I'm so hungry. All right. Let us eat some of this. Okay. Oh shit, I think we're about to have a dragon attack. Wait. I know you. Oh shit, yeah we are! Okay. Alright. Everyone, man- Man the everything the that there is to man! Falkreath is a fine place to be, Boland. Not right now! There's some pissed off asshole! I'm gonna shoot him with my stick! Get out of here! What is that on the side of the mountain? It looks like a shroomage. Or a silt strider. Is this thing gonna actually land, or is it gonna fuck off like all the rest? Yeah, come on and get me! 
Come on and get me, I'm doing my taunt. I'm gonna scream up at you, I'm gonna call out to you. Poof! Let's rumble! Yeah, let's do it, let's go! Can I actually shoot it with like a lightning bolt? I don't know, do the lightning bolts go on forever or do they fade out of existence? That motherfucker's getting out of here. Wow! Wow, 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 wow! Alright. Fine. Look at that! There's just like a little... Dangus coming out of the mountain. That's bizarre. Alright, cool. Well, we're in Falkreath. I suppose when next we come back, we will... Fix up and see about getting ourselves a nice little homestead here. Where we can have Ilya posted up and good shit, right? Because you know what? We've had too many fantastic adventures for Ilya to just, uh... Be cordoned off to... Fuck off town, right? Good lord. Alright, well, if you'd like to stick around, we will of course be doing a little bit of reading. And what's on our list of magical things to read this time? Well, I'm glad that you have asked. Let me see. <laughs> it's it's none other than the oh god <laughs> the Ethereum Wars. Let's see. This is related to content added in with the Dawnguard DLC, right? I believe so. You can get an Ethereum little bit of hootenanny, right? There we go. But we may as well read about it now. And then when we eventually come upon it, it'll be like magic, huh? The Aetherium Wars by Terran Dreth, dedicated to Katria, my friend and colleague. Oh, we've never had a dedication before, have we? The end, when it came, was swift. In the span of three short years, the great dwarven cities of Skyrim, from Markarth to the Velothi Mountains, fell before the armies of the High King cities that had held fast against the Nords for over a hundred years crumbled abruptly and without warning. For centuries, scholars have marveled at the sudden collapse of the Dwemer city-states. Even the Nords seemed to have been taken by surprise, though their chroniclers were quick to ascribe their success to King Jalir's inspired tactics and the blessings of Shore. My research suggests a much different cause, however. In the decades preceding their fall, the dwarven cities of Skyrim had been decimated by internal disputes and infighting over a most surprising cause, Aetherium. Isn't that a, a cryptocurrency? Or, no, I'm thinking of Ethereum, aren't I? I think. I'm not a cryptocurrency guy. Modern scholars know Aetherium as a rare luminescent blue crystal found in some Dwemer ruins. Most consider it little more than a curiosity. But, as it has proven all but impossible to work with, while it has a strong magical aura, it is alchemically inert, and no known processes process can enchant, smelt, mold, bind, or break it. To the dwarves, of course, such problems were merely a challenge. In the years following King Harald's reign, the Dwemer discovered a considerable source of Aetherium in their deepest delvings. An alliance of four cities, led by Arkhampons, the great research center in the Southern Reach, was formed to oversee its extraction, processing, and study, and, new, and a new Aetherium forge constructed to smelt it under precisely controlled conditions. If the inscriptions I discovered are to be believed, the results were nothing short of spectacular. The items produced by the forge were artifacts of immense power, imbued from the moment of their creation with powerful enchantments. The Dwarven Alliance shattered almost immediately as the four city-states and their rivals attempted to claim the forge. We can only speculate that none were successful. Decades of conflict merely weakened them all, allowing for King Gelair's subsequent conquests. 
and though the Dwemer reclaimed most of their lands a century later, there is no evidence that they ever resumed their research on Aetherium. Perhaps the costs had just been too great. But nothing like the Aetherium Forge described in the inscriptions has ever been found within the borders of Skyrim. It may have been destroyed long ago by the Nord invaders, or the Dwemer themselves. Or perhaps it, like the secrets of Aetherium itself, still remains to be discovered. <gasps> oh my god, what a thrilling tale! What a thrilling tale, and what a beautiful cover. Look at that. Oh, is it engraved with, like, marble? Jeez, they just put a whole bunch of rocks on this book. Honestly, you know what? Pretty effective, right? I guess if you were to make a cover out of anything, why not some hard-ass rocks, right? Honestly, that seems like a good idea. How come there aren't more book covers that are just, like, stone, right? Just for looks. Not to actually read, because, well, I guess if you wanted to read them, you'd get, like, one hell of a workout. <laughs> right? Shit. Damn, okay. You just read, like, <laughs> like a whole fucking anthology. You read uh, Frank Herbert's Dune, and all of a sudden, by the end of it, you're fucking jacked as hell. <laughs> read it at your standing desk. My god. All right. <laughs> well, when next we come back, the magic and wonder of Falkreath. Until next time, please take care of each other. <laughs>